People cannot but have the impression, however, with the Sophie Blanchu situation, that there was a, a, a clash of visions. There were two types of visions. You have been talking more dams. She was talking about more energy efficiencies. Is, was there a, class, a clash of visions that pushed her out? Was there, was there a political push to get her out of there? No, not at all. And I think she had some interviews since yesterday, and she was very, very clear that there was no uh, clash about uh, our visions. And what, what kind of a person do you think should take this job now? Will, will, will the, the next uh, president of Hydro be absolutely pro-development? But we need, uh, if we want to electrify Quebec, to increase by 50% volume at Hydro-Quebec uh, until uh, 2050. So of course we'll have to have somebody who's ready to develop uh, Hydro-Quebec. We also need to have a, a very good manager. It's a large company. So uh, I think uh, we will try to find the best uh, manager possible.